Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolotech, and today Apple released iOS 9.3 Beta 6. This is the sixth developer beta available for download. If you're a developer, usually the public beta will be out later on. It came in around 37.4 megabytes on my iPhone 6S Plus. Let's take a look at the version number. Here you can see this is version 13E5231A. Now this is really not much of an update. In fact, when we get to beta 6, we're almost done. In fact, this could be the last update. We're not really sure if they're going to do a gold master yet, but basically this update is a refinement of everything else. I haven't been able to find anything else. In fact, the screen lag still exists if I use 3D Touch, although it seems a little bit smoother and faster. Now overall in using this, the actual experience seems to be a little bit quicker. I see less slowness, really. I'm not sure exactly what they did, but it feels like they sped up the whole thing overall. I'm not really sure if that's true, but only time will tell. Now, as far as the features, nothing's really changed here. Night shift mode still works basically the same exact as it did before, and it looks really nice. Everything's basically refined at this point. So there's not a whole lot of new features in this particular beta update, but it's basically a final refinement. One thing to note is when I actually rebooted the phone after it installed and did its whole reboot, what it came up to was actually to sign into the phone and set up again. So you, you get the hello feature, you slide over, and then you actually sign into iCloud. So it made me do that, and that makes me think maybe this is the final release. So aside from uh, that one feature as far as night shift, Apple's added a bunch of different things, Wi-Fi calling for Verizon, Apple Music doesn't have... Uh, different playlists or either you don't have to add playlist songs to my music there's multiple Apple watch features that you can pair to iOS 9.3 so if you have multiple Apple watches you can pair multiple ones to your device and a bunch of little fixes and features all over the place so I think this may be the final release or maybe we'll have a gold master in a week or so and then Apple will release the final release hopefully within a couple of weeks they should have an Apple event coming up and we'll see some new iPads we think and some other little things here and there but if you found anything let us know in the comments if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe and like as always thanks for watching this is Aaron I'll see you next time oh and I left a link to the wallpaper in the description